Okay, I've stopped. Relax. Just the bruiser. Yep, the bruiser. The bruiser? You said you wanted to meet him. You know, Shirk, every one of these wrestlers has tried to hurt me. You've seen them. I've got over 300 stitches on my head and face. I've got broken elbows, broken arms. I've had broken knees, kneecaps, broken ankles. You know why, Shirk? Because every one of these bums tried to hurt the bruiser. But I beat him. Those were my greatest days. Now I want to know who is the villain. The escape. To see if I can do it. I read the news account of your burial. Very impressive, but dangerous. I even heard your little AM station went up a few rating points. Hey, whatever we come up with, I can promote it. Wrong. I promote you perform. But when the fans see it, they're going to like it. Wrong again. They have to like it before they see it. I don't know about this. You still need a confrontation. I'll find one. I'll find one. You just work on the act. That one. That's Satan. Me? Yeah, bit me once. What happened? Ten days intensive care. How dangerous is this going to be? My opponent, if you can call him that, he wants this Texas death match, which just shows how dumb he really is. So now he's going to get it. And one more thing. I'm the star of the night. I'm the feature attraction, not the shirt. That character wants to stay away. Shirt? What kind of name is that anyway? I'm the one the crowd pays to see. Not him. Not some garden snake. Well, now, I understand that a lot of fans want to see the shirt perform his escape, and it sounds pretty daring to me. Losing your virginity would sound good to you. Listen, I own that area. I own that fans you hear. And I don't want the fans subject to that stupid jerk who can be see a great wrestler like Ox Bigger. He says he was buried alive. Well, I'll show up that night. I'll bury him in this interview for good. Come on, Bubba. What's troubling you? I just don't want anything to happen. Don't worry. I'll play it safe. That'll be a first. You walk in the door, I'm gonna feel like I'm 10 feet high, honey. I can't wait. Oh, Lord, I'm gonna take you to every place in town. But, but, wait a minute. No, we gotta check out the place. I don't care where we go. I just so I, what, what's this going on? Oh, too much, too much. I mean, hey, is that? Ox, are you going to let him get away with this? Hey. Ox, are you actually going to let him get away with this? You can put his name on his tombstone. The Rattler's placed in that canvas bag there. Then it'll be tied over Shirk's head while he hangs upside down over the ring, bound by 55 feet of heavy-duty hemp. He'll then have to escape from the rope without getting bit by the rattlesnake. Has he done this before? No, Bob, this is the first time and the last if something goes wrong.
spike will pull Shirk up as high as that voice will allow. for WTTV Channel 4, and I'm standing here with the legendary Dick the Bruiser, and we're waiting for Bill Shirk to attempt his most daring escape today. Dick, I know you've been very instrumental in Shirk's career. Do you think he's crazy? Definitely, but I'm behind him 100%. Do you think he can do this? Sure he can. Is this dangerous? Not to me. What about to Bill? He enjoys danger. Well, thank you, Dick the Bruiser. Thank you, Linda. How about coming up to my place for supper tonight? <laughs> and we'll have a little something to do. 